Hi everyone. Hi Cancer. Welcome to your reading. Let's see what messages we show up for you, Cancer. Let's see. Spirit, what do we have for Cancer? Cancer. What do we have for Cancer? Angel of Balance and an anxiety. You're very stressed at the moment, Cancer. You have an angel of balance around you, so it is a sign that you need uh, you need to take it easy. Okay, there is something that's stressing you out very much, and you are you might be losing sleep over it. Very stressed, very worried, and anxiety, anxious about something. What we have, okay, free wanted you came out, fair enough. Let's see, we have kisses, unconditionally loving, giving, receiving affection, falling in love. We have camera, reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past, make memories. The snake, competition enemy, clever, malicious, look over your shoulder, the other woman. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I feel here very strong karmic energy, okay? It might be one of these reads, one of these reads about karmic who is just obsessing over you, okay? I feel, my dear Cancer, that someone is observing you. Okay, you might be feel very anxious that there is someone who you care a lot about, but you might suspect that this person is maybe losing interest a bit and their focus might be directed on someone else and that in indeed there might be another or other energy involved in this situation. We'll see. We'll see. I also feel very strongly that there is a karmic cancer who is a, and I feel it is a female energy. Okay, that it's very much looking at your picture, pictures. Yeah. Who might be a uh, obsessing over you? I I don't know. I very strong. I have this feeling this this bad energy came to the reading very much yeah someone jealous here they see you as a competition for them but we'll see we'll see we'll see okay spirit could you please show us important messages for cancer messages for cancer yes. okay i'll pull the cards first and then we'll talk about it okay a karmic indeed obsessing over you cancer okay cancer there is a disappointment here in your energy okay i have five of cups and i have four of cups i feel cancer that there was a rejection and I feel that uh, you were very much hurt by this because you gave so much affection, care. You invested in, 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 some, sort of, in some sort of situation, in a person, in, in a specific person. And you were just doing everything to, make, you know, to try to make it happen, to, 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 to make it work, okay? But I feel that this person very much hurt you. 
I feel that you felt rejected by them, by their actions. And it ultimately puts you in this Five of Cups energy, of energy of, of, of regret, of sadness, of disappointment. Some of the readers call the Five of Cups the River of Tears. So it is indeed a very sad energy about someone who is, maybe even you were thinking about the situation and you, there were moments that you were wishing that you could approach the situation from a different perspective or in a different way, that you could have turned back time and that you, you know, were in a completely different place, you, that you would avoid this situation. I feel that they put you in, a, in this kind of an anxiety indeed. I still think that you are thinking about the situation, okay? Because you gave a lot, you invested a lot. You are in the Empress energy here, Cancer. That's your energy, very much so. I feel you are dealing, you might be dealing here with a, with a strong fire sign. So, Leo, Aries, Sag, here. I feel you invested a lot in it. And at some point, I feel that they did something that you felt rejected, okay? The thing is, Cancer, that you are in this manifestation and it's very important for you to keep your mindset focused on your goal and be optimistic because you, I feel that you are not aware of your power here. You are incredibly powerful, incredibly powerful powerful and i'll tell you one thing if you want this person you can have them because this person who you felt rejected by it's coming back and i know it's a theme but i'm reading cards here and we have six of cups six of cups it's a card of past someone wants to reconcile and someone wants to be given another chance and i feel it is indeed this king of wands yeah. They see you in the Empress energy, which is an ultimate beauty, an energy of abundance, care, growth, stability. Empress is just an ultimate goal. Energetically, on a, on a, on a mentally, when it comes to emotions, it, she represents perfection. And that's how they see you. We have Ace of Cups here. Ace of Cups, it's a new beginning in love. Queen of Cups. This person has emotion. And I feel that you both, and you too, you, you, you indeed have love for this person. you manifesting them back. I don't know if you are aware of that, Cancer, but you manifesting this person back to your life because you have Magician next to you. You may be dealing here with Virgo, Taurus and I have strong Gemini as well you're manifesting them back to your life and they want to they want to come back they want another chance the thing is cancer this person is very smart they are perfectly aware that they hurt you they're thinking about it and they and they contemplating here how to approach the situation for you to welcome them back so this is an energy of being very um composed very very present okay they are thinking they are planning how to you know how what i should say because they are aware that you might reject them the way they treated you you know, they are perfect and, and they would not be able to stand rejection. I'm telling you. Oh, I'm telling you, Cancer. They don't like rejection. The problem this person has, okay, that they are surrounded by the chariot, the devil, and the four of cups. This person, it's toxic. You might be dealing with someone with narcissistic tendencies. They don't want to let you go. They don't want to give up on you because maybe you are posting something on social media, Cancer. You're looking good because you're in this Empress energy, so you must look incredibly uh, attractive. 
you know you might be liking someone else's photos you might be posting something on your social media they might see your interaction with other people and they are losing sleep over it they're coming from a place of lag and obsessing they they are you know there is they i mean it's, this is a very strong energy king of wands the chariot the devil the four of cups the thing is they are very determined to win you back but the thing is that they they haven't changed and they will not change cancer four of cups with with the devil mm -mm -mm. this is someone who is rejecting a change and someone who is very much stuck in their ways so they might be there might be addictions involved they might be they might be hugely manipulative they might be talking with many people and i feel and i will say that i feel they entertaining karmics okay because we have queen of pentacles here cancer and what she has she has in her head the devil energy and five of cups that karmic wants to reconcile with this king of wands okay that's why they might feel competition here the other woman there is something that you might even suspecting okay about this situation this is my chair sorry <laughs> but 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 indeed this king of wands is very desirable you know they know exactly what to say they know the tricks they've been doing it for so long And they, I feel that, you know, they, they, they do want you very much. I feel they're obsessing over you. And, um, and they do want to reconcile with you, but, but, but they are coming again with the same energy. I don't know what's happening here with those readings, guys. But we, overall, I feel the energy is that... Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, I feel strongly with, with regards to those readings that the Divine counterpart is very much coming from this kind of toxic energy here. And I see this, this through most of the reads I did, you know. But there is a shift, there will be a shift. Here, Cancer, you have someone else. That karmic is looking at your photos. They are perfectly aware that this King of Wands is very much attractive and they want to communicate to you. And they want to talk about this party. And they want to express their feelings towards you. And maybe even offer you an apology talk about emotions and about this parting and all of it and how they hurt you and they apologize because now they are ready for a long-term commitment and all of it and now they're not and the thing is that they entertain a wrong karmic here this 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 i feel that it is a female energy queen of pentacles this queen of pentacles it's it's she's very sneaky okay and she's quite fixated here as well on that on that king of wands she's perfectly aware of you she might be looking at your photos she feels very jealous she's very jealous of you cancer this is one of those reads you know, she might be even making these fake profiles in order to see your photos because we have camera and we have snake. And I do feel a big social media, especially with the chariot and the devil energy. So I feel that someone might be checking your social media from the fake account, looking at your photos. And she's jealous. She's jealous because she is very much fixated on this king of wands who wants you. 
they do have feelings for you because I would lie if they didn't and I don't want to do that because they do but they have their ways they are unhealthy they are toxic they are possessive it is my way or no way attitude they are very very stubborn autocratic you might be dealing with someone who has narcissistic tendencies and again you know falling in love receiving affection they want to give you affection this king of wands cancer but oh, i don't know i don't know i don't like this devil energy here i'll tell you that i really don't and this queen of pentacles also has this devil energy in the in her head you know he is thinking this king of wands he's thinking and he's completely aware that he hurt you but his basis is seven of swords so he's coming from this 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 manipulative mind game and kind of sneaky energy this is it is not sincere here okay they are obsessing over you but it, this person has issues i don't know it's cancer but it is because they they it seems that they have feelings for you they love you but they are very sneaky and they can't help themselves being that way okay okay i just feel that way about them i tell you one thing cancer at the end of the day you will win this because you have ultimately look you're starting the reading from five of cups being very sad reminiscing about the past there is it is a card of regret and pain and you are ending with, with a six of wands which is a card of victory you will have your victory you will have your your personal satisfaction with regards to the situation okay and i feel that it's hugely connected because you might ultimately decide to detach from that situation as much as you are uh, attracting and manifesting this person i feel you will gain your closure you will gain balance and I feel that you will take initiative to move forward a new beginning because you do have a new beginning in love. Okay, you do. You do. And I don't think you are interested anymore in any karmics and anyone who's projecting or involving you in that energy because you don't want to feel, no one wants to feel bad. No. And you have your victory here. Because I feel ultimately, Cancer, you will decide to detach yourself. And that will be a major step. That will bring you fulfillment. Okay. Cancer, you might be dealing also with Capricorn, Cancer. I have also an F sign here. Very strong. So Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah, we have Capricorn here as well. With the balance, I, I have said it can be. Okay, let's see. Two of Pentacles. Okay, let's see ultimate message for Cancer, please. What do we have? Two of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, Eight of Swords. Cancer, this is an ultimate message for you. If you choose that person, that person puts you in a Knight of Swords, an Eight of Swords uh, energy. And I feel that would be a, you will repeat the cycle with this person. Okay? Because there will be a choice. You will have to make a decision if you want this person back. If you decided to make this person, if you decided to welcome this person back to your life, this person will put you in a position of you being stuck unable to move you they will be holding you back with regards to your growth and you being simply happy what you will feel it's ultimate anxiety stress and worry which is this card you see she's lying in bed as well like nine of swords energy lady here so 
you know, think about it, Cancer. Think about it. Because it is something to consider. Cards are very clear about this situation. You are protected, don't worry. You have Angel of Balance, so that karmic here, who is coming because it's in the devil energy, attached to this King of Wands, who are not, won't do anything to you. You are completely protected here on a, on a spiritual level. So you don't have to be worried about that, Cancer. Hmm. Cancer, thank you very much for being with me. I truly hope that this reading resonates with you. I, I am aware that it might not, but I hope that it does <laughs> fully. And um, please take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. Okay. I truly wish you all the very best. Please like, share and subscribe. And, um, and once again, thank you so, so very much. And please take care. Thank you. Bye.